My name's Tom, and my book is on A Wrinkle in Time by Madeline Glengel. The main protagonist is a character named Meg Murray. Right, this is her. Okay, so Meg, you know, she's, oh shoot, she's, she's not that happy, dude. She's, she's actually kind of like, She's kind of sad, like boo-hoo, you know, because all these people like make fun of her, yelling stuff about making fun of her at school, right? And you know why they make fun of her at school? You won't believe it, bro. Because her father's missing, dude. That This is her father. He's missing. He's he's not here anymore. Like, he's out of the picture. He's gone. He's like in another dimension or something. That's crazy, bro. It's crazy. Okay, so at school, Meg meets this boy. His name's, his name's Calvin, right? It's like, they become friends, right? Because, like, he loves her for who she is. Okay, so, they see these, this little haunted house, right? And you know what they say? Let's explore it, because that's smart. But then, like, you know, Meg's little brother, Charles Wallace, wants to come too, because he's a little, he's a little brat, you know? Like, la, 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 la. They go in the haunted house, right? Woo! Okay, so in the haunted house, being smart children they are, they talk to three strange women named Mrs. What's it? Mrs. Who? And Mrs. Witch. Alright, so these three ladies, nice ladies, they're like, we know where your father is, Meg. And Meg's like, wow, really? And they're like, uh, and they're like, yeah. So, Meg's like, Okay. Alright, so the three ladies, they're like, come follow us. Right? Do these words. Right? And, of course, those three, they're like, sure thing. Nice ladies. And then, like, they follow them through the woods. All of them. It's crazy. Oh, as they were walking through the forest, they start feeling a little bit weird, right? Like, ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh my God! They start like going through this portal thing, right? It's called a, it's called a tesseract. So the tesseract it made them go from our little planet Earth all the way over here to another unknown planet, unknown how far away it is. Very quickly, make the discovers that this planet is like everyone's the same. No, no one has individuality. Like they're all doing the same thing. No one's different, right? So obviously, make. She's kind of freaked out by this, right? So she she goes to this town called Kamazuts, right? Or something like that. And there she sees she sees this brain called It, right? And you know what? It has her father, right? And what happens next is unbelievable. Are you ready for it? Yep. Read the book to find out, buddy. A Wrinkle in Time by Madeline Lengel. Lengel. I would rate this book 5 out of 5 stars. Because, you know, I really love stories that go into a different world. Different from the one we're in right now. And also, I could not put the book down when I started reading it. It's a really good read. It's only 250 pages long, so it's really quick too. And that's why I enjoyed this book and I'm giving it 5 out of 5 stars. The end.